Hi guys, it's day five and we're pulling into Puerto Rico. We just got off the boat. There it is. And now we're walking around. Our first stop, there's a Walgreens over there that we're gonna go to. There's the shed. And then there's a bunch of stores. I mean, a bunch of stands. That's the restaurant we just ate in. It was very good. this cafe I don't know what it's called but it's a wine and coffee place oh look you can get Nespresso's over there we're walking back on the ship and they have two gangways here this one and that one and I have to turn off my camera because no camera during security we just came back to the room, and here's, I'm gonna say, it's a monkey. What do you think that is, Steve? A monkey? Looks like an Eskimo. An Eskimo? Yeah, that could be. And it's beautiful outside, but it's hot as blazes out there. I was watching the TV because we have it on the bridge cam. And the guy's That's cleaning the window. That's a good man. Doing good. Oh my goodness. Making sure the good old captain could see. Hey guys, so it's around 3.18. It's actually 3.18. And I'm sitting out in the balcony just watching the view. There's a lot of, I think, excursions. Like, there's jet skis and... Oh, you can kind of see the the mirror there there's jet skis and sailboats um and other other types of vessels out there and i was trying to look for dolphins because three years ago when i came to puerto rico on a cruise i saw dolphins but no such luck and it was hot out there when we were walking on the pier but right now out in the balcony because the sun is not directly shining on us it's very nice and uh, you can sit out here uh, not sure what the afternoon holds but just we prefer to be back on the ship earlier tomorrow is not going to be the case because we our excursion is from 10 to 2 and we need to get back on the ship by 2 30 but it's a carnival sponsored excursion so it shouldn't be a problem even if we're late and planes they land right over there on oh, a helicopter, I'm going to be taking off. to the highest deck you can go to. I think that's 12. And see the boat take off in about 10 minutes, hopefully. I still see people walking down there that are part of the cruise ship, but we're on the Serenity deck. I don't want to take pictures of anybody. But these are our chairs right there. And then that's more of the ship over there. Okay, we're starting to move away now. They were calling the same group of people over and over again. So hopefully they made it on the ship. I think that's what that was for. And I have my Miami Vice, which is so good. And we're pulling off. And I think 
we have to turn around, but that's the that's the pier we were just on. And so it's weird. You go through this building and they have like some duty free upstairs and they were selling liquor downstairs. But then you go through there um, into Old San Juan. And we did the fort last time, which, oh, you know what? I could show you the fort. I'm gonna go see the fort over there. I'll be right back. Your chest is on. one of the forts. I'm not sure if that was the one that we walked when we were here three years ago, but we're leaving. We're turning around actually. Here's the back of the ship so where the funnel is. Oh Steve, people are doing the ropes course. While we're leaving, we can pass by the fort, and that, that is the one that we walked. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna zoom in. Okay, I'm inside and I'm gonna get on a glass elevator, I think. Waiting. The lady, the Swiss, she's directly in me. She looks like she be having fun. Yeah. She do? Everybody be having fun. Oh, wow. Play board games. Oh, oh. decade. Veranda. Eight. Look at TV, man. He loves you. but I'm going entering the fun shops. I thought I'll show you. So they have clothes. Swag. I think I might get this. Hey guys, so I just came back to the room about 10 minutes ago. I was at the casino. It didn't open up until around 5.45 because we had to wait to get into international waters. If you're not familiar with the rules, the casinos close on port days and then once we hit open waters or international waters, they open the machines again. And before that, we were up on the highest deck, Serenity deck, and 
uh, we were seeing the boat take off, which was really fun. And if you don't get to see the fort, which is a main attraction in Puerto Rico, you are able to see it from the boat. And that was pretty cool. We took some pictures up there. And then Steve went to the sauna because he got a week pass. And my sister and her boyfriend decided to go to the buffet uh, just to get a little nosh. We really only ate at around 11.30. We went to a recommendation a restaurant that was recommended to us by uh, my boyfriend's sister, and it was really good. It was, I'm gonna butcher this name, but it was Raices. I'm not sure. R A I C E S. So close to the ship. Uh, we also stopped by Walgreens where we ran into the cruise director, the Flying Scotsman, which was funny. My sister needed to get medicine, much cheaper than on the ship. And yeah, we just walked around. We didn't want to do the whole walking around the fort thing it was super hot it was just unbearably hot and i know that going you know on a cruise in um july the weather is going to be super hot but like yesterday we didn't mind because we were by the water and we went into the water and the water was beautiful so i can be in the sun but i need to have some type of water thing near me whether it's a pool or a beach and then today, we we have been here before, me and Steve, and we did the fourth thing, which was really great. Uh, but we just did a walk around, and we wanted to go to Umbrella Street, and we asked, we went to this really popular, like, gelato slash ice pop stand, and the guy said that because of the protest, the umbrellas weren't there anymore or something like that, so we missed that, but that's okay. And uh, tomorrow, we do have an excursion, which I'm super excited about. It's a waterfalls tour, and it's supposed to be four hours long, so we shall see. I don't, I don't know what to expect. I We have done excursions before with cruises, uh, and I'm not... I'm really happy with the choices that we made so far so hopefully this one is really good we have the tickets already it's through carnival and yeah right now i'm gonna eat my i t i wasn't gonna go to the buffet because i didn't want to ruin my appetite it's so close to dinner time which ours is at a 15 so i have my <laughs> half of my ham and cheese sandwich i had ordered room service before we left today and for some reason i got this so i put the put this half in the fridge got orange juice and coffee and what I do is I order the coffee I have ordered the coffee in the morning and then I'll keep the rest because it's too much for me to drink in one setting and then I'll have it throughout the day and that pot that I have right there I don't know if you can see it with the orange lid that keeps it really warm and hopefully that wasn't decaf because I I know that's how places differentiate between regular and decaf coffee it was fine uh yeah so i might take a rest and then i'll see you back at dinner time and it, i keep on forgetting to end the vlogs for every day so there's gonna be a lot of vlogs from this cruise where it just ends so i'm gonna try to remember to vlog an ending bye <laughs>